Hi, uh, today we'd like to go over another training procedure for you in reference to serving the tables. So you'll notice here that we've kind of mocked up this table in regards to serving the salad course. And we're also gonna show you the proper way to serve the entree course. And so that's the two areas of service we're gonna focus on in this video today. And um, hopefully this will help you when you're serving your tables so that way you can be more proficient. So we're gonna assume that for this demonstration, positions one and four are ladies and positions two and three are gentlemen. So they've already ordered. My food runners brought out their food, which is sitting over here on our cart ready to go. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna serve our ladies first, as we've always discussed, is the proper way to serve. Um, one thing you wanna do, I would recommend that you only take two plates at a time. I know some people like myself can carry up to three plates if needs be, but again, if I do that and I go to serve, I'm now on the wrong side of the individual or I need to be on the left side. So I'd only recommend doing two at a time. That way we can make sure that we maintain proper etiquette when we're serving. So I'm gonna come around and serve the salads here. Serve this lady on the left. And serve this lady on the left. And go back for my other two salads for the gentleman. Come over here and serve this gentleman. And come back around and serve this gentleman. So as you can see, I got all the salads laid out and we're ready to go on to pepper, which is also on my cart. So again, when you're presenting pepper, we've talked about this a little bit already, wanna make sure you're standing on the right side of the individual. Um, it's the proper way to go about serving pepper. You don't wanna be serving some pepper on the left side. The only time you should really be on the left side is when you're serving either entrees or salads or soups. Everything else should really be on the right side. Excuse me with that, two desserts and appetizers. When you're serving food, you should be on the left. When you're doing anything else, you should be on the right. So I'm gonna come up here, and again, we're gonna offer pepper to people. Would you like some fresh ground pepper? They say yes, you go ahead and pour it, grind it out, and then you come over to the next side. Would you like some fresh ground pepper? And continue around the table until you've hit up every individual. And once you're done with that, you go and grab your serving tray and take it back to the kitchen. So we'll be back in just a few minutes to kind of go over with you the proper way for entree service. So next we want to show you how the proper techniques are for serving the entrees. As you notice here at our table, we've already cleared the salad plates and we're ready to go with entree service. One thing that we want to make mention of too is when you're serving this, if you come to the table, um, and notice that they're using their butter knives, for example, if this was up here, we would like to leave it there so that way they can continue to use it. If that person needs another butter knife, you're gonna to wanna to replace that ahead of time. Another thing that we've been talking about is marking our tables. So for example, let's say I've got uh, these two people here having steaks. So you notice on the tray that we have here, clean tray, clean linen, we have two steak knives ready to go for marking. You're gonna come out with that and set the steak knife down in the appropriate spot. Now where this person still has their knife, we're gonna go ahead and place the steak knife down, but then pull away the other additional knife because they're not gonna need it for their entree at this point, especially if they haven't used it. Again, if they're currently using their knife for bread and butter as you see here, then we're just gonna leave that there until after the service is done. So now that we've got our steak knives down, I see the food runner coming with my food and wheeled out on the cart and left here for me. Again, the same procedure as we did before. We're gonna serve the ladies first, again at positions one and four, and then positions two and three are our gentlemen. So we're gonna go ahead and start serving like we normally would. I'm gonna come up here, serve this lady first. And I'm gonna come up here and serve this lady next. Now one thing to keep in mind too, you notice here, if we can get a closer shot of this, that I have the B&B &B in the way. So what we're gonna do before we set it down is we're gonna to wanna to just move that B&B &B up a little ways and then set it. Keep in mind when you're setting the plates down, we want them to be centered of the place setting and not hanging off the edge like this. 
okay? That's pretty important for us because obviously we don't want this to fall into the person's lap. So make sure that you have plenty of room as you go around setting it. So I'm coming up to my next two individuals to serve and I noticed right away I've got his drink that he'd been sipping on while he's waiting for his entrees to come up is in the middle of his place setting. So what I'm gonna do here at this point, he's gonna see me coming with the food and he'll probably back away. So I'm gonna come up on this side first, move his stuff out of the way, so that way I have plenty of room, and then come around on the left side like you normally would to serve him and place that down. And then same thing at this position, I see the wine glass is in the way, so again, I'm gonna come up here, just push the wine glass out of the way, walk around the table, and place my entree down. Obviously, I should have moved that B&B plate just a little bit too prior to me serving. Um, these are just a few of the things that we wanted to show for you today about proper serving. Again, we're gonna go over another one in another few days here about a clearing procedure so you can understand that. Plus, we'll have some other videos coming out for you that'll help you when you are serving your tables at the club. Thank you.